I want to evolve. What type of energy do I give off? Are you the enemy, the root of all? Evil in people, that's why they fall. I want to evolve. Not just for me, but I mean y'all. Are you the enemy, the root of all? Negative entities, yeah, who's involved? I want to evolve. What's up, world? Boy Ray back here again with another topic. It is that time again, holiday time, so I invite you to join me on a fast. This one won't be that long. I'll be fasting. Well, I've already started my fast today, but 72 hour fast for you if you would like to um, through the holiday just to honor our fallen ancestors and those who are slaughtered on these uh, holidays. For me, um, this is not only just a food fast um, or just honoring a food fast. I've been two months sober from smoking marijuana and I've been two months no fap as well. Um, if you're wondering what that feels like, it's just empowering. It's just empowering. Just having more energy for yourself, having more control for yourself. You are not pulled by things that bait you things sent to destroy your peace. That's the best thing about it. You have more control over yourself. You know, even when you do know before why you're doing those other things, you can get pulled into situations where you know better. You know it might be, might be a, a, a gamble just to deal with it. But now you won't even, you won't even roll the dice you won't even play you save that energy for you um, two months I think two months is about the time where you really start to gather your stride you really start to start understanding your energy and using it more wisely um, just 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 starting the fast says a lot about what you're trying to do but you have to get through certain obstacles you have to get through certain through certain milestones to uh, get where you're trying to go I mean you might be trying to get into a room but you got to get through you got to get that key in the door and you got to get through a whole bunch of other doors in order to get to where you're trying to go so I really don't have much to say on that I'll be fasting from 24th to the 28th and I've already started my fast I did a water fast today tomorrow I'll be doing a dry fast for Christmas Christmas you know if you if you're more if you're indigenous you don't know, really celebrate these pagan holidays and you know my heart goes out to anybody who's feeling lonely who's feeling like they not getting anything, uh, you know, that's that's the downside of all of these holidays. Even, you know, Valentine's Day, New Year's, whatever the case may be, it's, it's the downside to it too. Like every everybody around you seems to have somebody and, but you can't be left out when you're set apart. You gotta understand that if you're different, if you question the things around you, people are gonna try to target you and make you feel like you left out, but you're already set apart. You're already different. Doesn't mean you're better. Doesn't mean you're above. You're just, you're different. All right, so think about it. Think about fasting. Think about doing something different. You know, think about testing your body, testing your mind becoming better, evolving, feeling something different. I mean, the choice is yours, ultimately, but life is gonna test you as well. 
life is gonna touch you as well. You might you might need to access that 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 knowledge and that that fortitude one day to just tough just to get through some tough times. I mean life might just have you fasting just because you don't have any money to eat. Life gonna touch you to be alone because you, you know all the people that you love and put so much energy into it, use that energy to go and do something else. So make it a ritual, just like these holidays, just like these special events that happen. Make it a ritual to take care of you first and foremost. And what comes with fasting is just resting. Storing up your energy. We put so much, we put so much energy into other people, and we put so much energy into eating. We put a lot of energy into food, grocery shopping, cooking, eating, then resting. What if you use that energy for something else? What if you allowed your body to to flush out all the toxins, the parasites? And your body wasn't spending so much energy on breaking down that food. What you gonna eat next? What, you know what I'm saying? Where's the next meal gonna come from? Not being satisfied with what you eat. That's funny, right? Like, if somebody asks you where you wanna go to eat at, that's a tough question. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> But anyway, man, we'll be fasting through the holiday. I'll eat for three days and I'll go on another fast or for New Year's. So it's just testing your body. And another thing I wanted to mention, I, I was reading on how um, other religions, you know, fast. I mean, not religions, but traditions. Cultural traditions, they fast. And I was looking at the, the Karwa Choth. How um, Hindu women, they fast for a day to honor, you know, and honor not only honor their husbands, but to wish them, wish them well, wish them the best, wish them prosperity. And Unmarried women do it as well to, you know, hopefully in hopes to attract a husband. I just think that's that's so dope. I think that's so amazing. Um, so I think that's definitely something I'm going going to incorporate into my life. And, you know, you end up meeting somebody that's that's on the same frequency with you, and y'all want to push it to it. Uh, you know, even if just a physical thing. Um, being there for each other, then why not fast with each other for a weekend? Why not fast with each other for a week? Why not? If y'all gonna be together, y'all gonna be around each other, if y'all gonna be, means if you gonna be inside her and she gonna be inside your head, why not test it out? Because if you can't if you can't fast for a day or two, think about all the other things you're not willing to go through for the person that you say you want to be with. Just something to think about. But that's it, man. Fasting for this for the Christmas summer solstice for this you know holiday. Just testing ourselves and becoming better, evolving, not being pulled by or controlled by the lights, the, the other energies that's pulling you every which way, the sales, the food, all of that. Just setting yourself further apart from the BS. All right? Peace.